Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. I would like to start my topic today with a very simple question. Have you ever been cyberbullied before? If yes, hands up. OK, a few, two of you. All right, there are two reasons for this. First is, we all know that cyberbullying uh, always happens among those teenagers, which means, well, we are not young anymore. Accept that. <laughs> All right. And the second one is only one of the 10 cyber victims will inform others for their abuse, which makes cyberbullying much difficult to be detected. Well, nowadays, like um, cyberbullying detector always focus on the bad words. However, um, only focus on bad words are not enough for cyberbullying detection. For example, if two close friends, they will send each other with uh, bad words. But uh, actually, we cannot say these messages are belong to the cyberbully. So in our research, we first build a social, we first build a cyber, uh, social network relationship graph. And then we use a social network analysis to understand the cyber, online social network analysis. And then we use. Um, uh, based on the social network analysis, we can understand their relationship, online relationship in Twitter. And then uh, based on the current and previous uh, social science and uh, psychology literature, we built three hypotheses to test with our social network data. And uh, compared with non-booting group, we found that uh, in so first in, social, uh, in cyber booting group, um, they have less connection. So which means like they have uh, less connection with others. And secondly, we found that uh, people inform involved in cyberbullying are, are more likely to be friends, but not very close friends. And thirdly, we found that uh, so, uh, the cyber victims, they are, have a higher online activity than others. So in our research, uh, after that, we built a machine learning model for detect the cyberbullying. And we found the results show us a social network analysis can help us to improve the cyberbullying detector, detect, detector and uh, make a conclusion. Our research is not only use uh, social network analysis to uh, detect the cyberbullying, but also understand the cyber, cyberbullying much better. Um, and uh, in future, it's open a window for us to understand and uh, explain other online phenomena. Thank you so much. Thank you.